Usually, when you record vocals, bass and guitar in BandLab, the track is recorded in mono. Tap on the mixer settings icon at the bottom left of the track mixer screen. And you can see the pan icon just to the right of the volume slider that is below the track name is set by BandLab to the center. And this means all your mono tracks are stacked on top of each other in the middle of the mix. And that is a bad, bad mix for your song. It was her. I was dreaming of On my mind Thinking of love Really, only the main vocal track and maybe the kick drum should be in the middle of the mix. You can, of course, pan the bass guitar and your backing vocals to the left or right, and that is fine if you want the song to sound like a live recording. It was her. I was dreaming of On my mind Thinking of love But normally you want the bass guitar and backing vocals to play the same volume out of both stereo speakers. Now, you could tap on the three dots to the right of the track name and tap on Duplicate. Then press on the pan icon and drag your finger up or down the screen. So one track is panned right in the stereo mix and the other is panned to the left. It was her I was dreaming of On my mind Thinking of love This does mean though that you use two tracks instead of one track and BandLab has a limit of 16 tracks. And if both tracks have the same effects added, then not only does that use more processing power and memory, but the effects can affect each other and ruin your mix. And this is where we can use the Stereo Wise effects instead. The Stereo Wise effects basically takes the mono track sound and pans it right and left at the same time. So, in essence, it turns the mono track into a stereo track. At the bottom of the track record screen, tap on the effects icon. Then tap on create below the none effects preset icon or tap on customize below your custom preset effects icon. Tap on the plus icon at the top of the effects preset screen. Scroll through the tabs at the top of the effects preset screen and tap on the utility tab. Now tap on stereo wise. The stereo wise effects has three sliders, low, high and size. The size slider sets how far the mono track is panned left and right. Drag the dot on the line to the right of the word size to the left until it says 5.0 below the word size. This will pan the sound 50% of the way to the left 
and 50% of the way to the right in the stereo mix. It was her. I was dreaming of. Drag the dot on the line to the right of the word size to the right until it says 10 below the word size. This will pan the sound all the way to the left and all the way to the right in the stereo mix. It was her. I was dreaming of. Setting the size to zero effectively turns off the stereo effects. It was her. I was dreaming of. The high and low sliders set how much of the higher frequencies or how much of the lower frequencies are added to the stereo mix. It was her. I was dreaming of On my mind Thinking of love In this video, I will pan the bass guitar track to 2.0 and pan the backing vocals to 10. It was her I was dreaming of On my mind Thinking of love 